Hi teammates, let's dive into some mysteries. Right here we have Yusuf al Mutman Ibn Hud, uh, Banu Hud, third king. Okay? This is going over the guys who are Bruco. Bruco the truth seeker. Known as Bruno or Bruco on YouTube. Bruco, right here. Okay? So we have Al Adil Kidbuga, twelve ninety two AD. You can see all this here. So we've got the ciphers. Just going to show you all this, okay? So Yusuf al Mutamin Ibn Hud died 1085. Then I believe he was a twin figure of Al Adil Kidbuga and Abu Yaqub Yusuf An Nasir. Died 1307 and died. Uh, 1303, those guys. So what I see is a buffalo torso with black mamba abdominal and Chinese water dragon legs, feet and tail. It has two heads and necks of seahorses, all to scale. Okay? So that's the twin figure I see. This creature's father, just like the Nemean lion and Orthrus and the Sphinx figure, are all father to son. Like, um, that's Paul Walker, that's Legion figure. Like Hendrik Goldzius and Nathar Shaw and Chavandaraya. Well, it's the same thing with this. Um, this creature's father, like who he was before, is Rafiki headed humanoid lion. With Hender Gold's finger that becomes wand goes through Red Sea like men in black training interview scene. So I had said that represents myself, but as you know on my channel, sometimes I say it's myself, but uh, it's actually other people. So because I, I show a lot of the symbolism of everyone else, so just bear with me here. And then the creature's son is lion torso, hippo legs, Japanese macaque head, gorilla arms, human hands. That's year one of 14 years old, but that, that could be longer for him, uh, for Bruco. And, uh, that's, that's mine and his. Okay. That's me when I was one to 14 years old. And that's Bruco as well. Okay. Is this, uh, Lion torso, hippo legs, Japanese macaque head. And we both have human hands. And um, so that's our creature. You know, that's that's Bruco. So, and then I've got this too. Um, this is me taking the Tupac JFK figure and making it according to my life, okay? So I don't know if this is accurate. But uh, this is what I see. The first piece, Ma Sie What, that's my OCD that I had when I was a kid. Japanese honor. Leon body braced for pectus carinatum is what I had. Um, that, this is the Tupac-headed creature, okay? Um, or that's actually the second piece. This one, this one is a uh, lion, lion uh, torso. And that's what that is. That's the ch that's the uh, brace for my chest. Uh, I had a bony hip when I was um, like without smoking weed or anything, and uh, my hip got real like calcified whenever I started smoking weed. It was like I was uh, going through the pineal gland symbolism of wrestling with God or whatever. And then that's the gorilla arms study. My hands, okay? So, 
I'll zoom in on this and you can take a look and see what you think. Um, and then we have the Tupac. Black Mamba Ab, study his breast, mad, deep down, ant le equals ant legs, Popeye, car, Ultima. Um, I, I smashed my dad's Ultima when I was in high school and it, it didn't get fixed for a long time, but uh, it wasn't my fault. Somebody rammed into me, but that's the Popeye. And then third beast, October, it's around October or November. Is what I'm seeing here. JFK, that's J Watchman. That's when I started becoming a watchman. Arms with magneto based. Silichiforma. That's the shark, the shark, uh, symbolism. And then a Mark Camp in a jar. You can take a look at all this. That's when I was working electric. Um, holding back the Dharma is the wings tucked. The wings tucked is just like the uh, Hoover Dam. And then the fifth beast, Cerro Malas, Chuck Walla head is what that.